It's a reimagining of the nativity story that we've heard so many times before that we all know. If you grew up with that story, you very much so know it like secondhand. But this one is done in this lighthearted, joyous, funny, uh, from the perspective of the animals. It just allows for a wider range of ages to participate, I think, in sure. this one film. I think what you're saying is it's not like necessarily, well, let's put it in, in a category. Do you feel like this is a movie just for Christians or, or no. how? No, faith-based films in general, no matter what, base they're in is an opportunity for you to educate yourself on something maybe you did not grow up with. So for me, I think it's a, the reason why it makes it so special is that it tells the story in a way that can allow someone new to the story to not feel overwhelmed or, um, or condemned. But on the contrary, it's like, it's a window into the stories that we grew up with. So I think that if you have an opportunity to hear a story of someone else's perspective of love and their origins of their love, then why not? For centuries, one story has touched the lives of people across the world. This holiday season, you're invited to discover the story of the first Christmas from an entirely new perspective. Hang on! Cyrus! Jonah! I expected a left turn two deserts ago. Oh, these wise guys are lost. That's it. I'm fighting through the reins. From the studio that brought you miracles from heaven and cloudy with a chance of meatballs. Huh? Whoa. Stephen Young, Keegan Michael Key, Gina Rodriguez, Zachary Levi, Kelly Clarkson, Patricia Heaton, Kristen Chenoweth, Tyler Perry, Tracy Morgan, and Oprah Winfrey. King Herod is up to something. That's what Christmas means. Mary, you're in danger. You need to listen to what I'm about to say extremely carefully. <laughs> Do you want a belly rub? Oh. A star. <laughs> you jump out and create a distraction. Hey, hmm? here it goes! There's something seriously wrong with those animals. 